Hey guys, Cruisnik X back with more Final Fantasy XIV goodness. Alongside me is BBC Da and Keenemo Sobriety, who who decided to join us because game night got cancelled. Um, so we let, we're well into the Hildebrand quest lines. When we last left off, we were still looking for the fucker. We did stumble across uh, Godbert and uh, this new guy, Seer. I don't know why he's here. But, <clears throat> but um, we'll get right down to it and hopefully finish this. Who do they think they are com coming doing this investigation? And then playing a zombie as a bloodhound? It beggars belief. We must regain control of this situation. With me, Bayon! Yeah, with you. Where's my keyboard? Uh. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna use a different mount than I usually use. Look at his See? little fat butt! I fucking love it. The only thing you need to study is your ass. I got a big ass. BBC's got a big ass. You do have a big ass. Don't blame me. Your ass is a big in this country. So you need to get used to that. And I don't give a fuck what diet you go on. You can throw up your stomach and your ass or you're going to always be fat. What, you never saw the Nutty Professor? Oh, yeah. It's like, I got a big ass. Your mama got a big ass. Cletus, you do have a big ass. <laughs> Come on, man. That's cruel and unusual punishment right here. Oh, he doesn't care. He's like, give me. Give, give me, me that food. food. I want it. I want it. <laughs> what? He's making them fly? It's cake. He's <laughs> like, you can fucking fly. Yeah, you can fly. I can't fly right now because I haven't attuned all the ether currents here. I should probably go back and grab that one, but I just don't feel like it. Plus, our destination is like right here. It's like watching a corgi walk. It's so cute. Little chubby butt. Oh, chubby butt. Oh, what the? Oh, no, it's that that's one. a fat chubby. Um, no, 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 and Godbird doing squats again. Yep, Godbird. Hold a moment, my friend. I just love the part. Like, I must need to concentrate. Damn, it's all hell no. <laughs> oh, hell no. <laughs> Hold a moment, my friends. I must need to concentrate. Master Zombiebrand is indeed nearby. There is also something else. They have a powerful magic confounding my senses. I can guide you no further. You must need split up and search the area. Now see here, these wastes are infested with wild beasts, and you would have a split up. Bayon can handle him himself, true, but you clearly know, and you clearly know reason to fear death. But what of Mistress Nashu? Ah, oh, I take your meaning, my good zombie, Bayon. Pray, see to the lady's protection. Inquisitor Sir, would you care to take the lead? Come on, you two. The inspector is out there somewhere! She seems like the type that would get in trouble and not know it until it's like about to attack her and then one of her protectors just comes and kicks it. And she's like, oh, Maya, where were you? And he's just like, oh, you should see. You know. No, you should just, see just some of the bullshit I've had to endure with these fuckers. Just, just Back in A Realm Reborn, there was so much bullshittery at work. Jack and Dexter, the entire series, is downloaded on the PlayStation 4. Good one, Dolan! Jack and Dexter. Nice. I love that game. That one is like one of my favorite games. I bear. I've, I have barely played Spike Hoopa. Uh, I'm serious! Come on, see? There, there it is. Oh, hello, hello. Hola, como estas? Here we go. <clears throat> Did I put the rest in there? No, I didn't. 
Lip fan! That's got to be the inspector! Oh, yeah. And it's surrounded by giant fluffy match shaped gazebos! It totally is. Really? What is it with you and gazebos? Why is he fucking in the snow like that? Because he landed there. Nay, my lady. They are not mere gazebos. Oh, not their regal parody. They are gentlemen gazebos. Oh, no. Fearsome yet prestigious foes who would surely tear me rotting limb from rotting limb. Oh, what? So I can... Only I can do this? Yeah. Only Bayon can save Master Zombibra now? Okay, so it's Gobbert and Zombibra? No, it's Hildebrand, but... Oh, he calls him Zombibra. Yeah. You know what? Create new gear set. Uh, set the hot bar. Put that there, and there we go. Oh, duh. Hitting the wrong button. Oh, that's cool. You can your outfit like that. Uh, yeah, and I didn't have the right part of my outfit. There we go. Recommended. Equip. Saved. Oh, snap. They made a magic circle around no, that's just the uh, danger circle. You know what? For one last run, Why are you talking about that? get it out of the way. We might as well. We might as well release Tenchi for one last hurrah. Because this is like one of the last things I have to do before I go back to Chris Valentine. Use this character. That was the skill you were talking about last episode. Yeah, the teeth. Yeah, that's Unleash. Okay, that's pretty much everything that was it with that. Why? <laughs> like, uh, uh, guys. <clears throat> Inspector! Inspector! Can you hear me? We've been looking all over for you! Nah. No, he's just asleep. Oh, but this just won't do. We've got to get you out of there before you catch cold. Come to the other door. The one that looked like Master Yoshi. Is that him? This is dead. This looks yeah, so he's wrong. Like pulling him up <laughs> in <the> direction. <sighs> up, up and at him, everyone is waiting for you. Sure. <sighs> Forgive me. If I pull any harder, my arms are like to tear. Ah, there you are. We heard shouting. Have you perchance found something? Daddy. Fury, take me. Is that my heretic? Confound it, I wanted him alive. Inspector Hildebrand is definitely not a heretic. And he's probably not dead either. He's... he's just hibernating, like last time. Hildy ever was a late riser. Fear not. My wife and I had our ways of waking him. Like, yeah, you yeah, might want to back wanna... up. Get out of there. Yeah! <laughs> they even shot it! <laughs> God, Hildebrand, Heliodor, Maximilian, and Mandeville, wake up right this 
Unstunned! <laughs> he just gets knocked back. <laughs> No, he fucking gets flown up into the air by No, his... no, the other guy gets knocked back. Oh, yeah. His fucking godlike father. Go ahead, daddy. Oh! 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 Oh my god, is this a suplex for fuck <laughs> It's gonna hurt! <laughs> Why would you suplex your son? Like a that? normal person would get killed by this. Because that's how they bond. Like, look at him. He, You can clearly tell he's used to this shit. Look at him. He's prepared Especially... for impact. <laughs> oh my god! Oh god! He's like, Jenny! <laughs> Oh no. And now they're both in there! <laughs> no, he put them <laughs> further in the ground! <laughs> hmm. Was it the Mandeville Meteor Strike or the Mandeville Meteor da Drive? Ah, uh, maybe Julian was right. Trying to name everything only leads to needless confusion. One more okay. time then. Out you go! The fuck? Who's that? Where'd he grab that from? Hmm? Huh? Oh, Manderville done. Oh, the other one. Splendidly suplex, Lord Godbutt! Splendidly suplex, Lord Godbutt! Manderville man, Manderville man, can only dance like a Manderville oh can. God. That's the Manderville man dance. Where. Where am I? The snowy like waste. <laughs> the snowy That's waste. Like of... Yeah, I, I know. Love him. Where? <laughs> oh Where am I? The snowy wastelands of Carthus. And who are these people I see before me? Ah, but of course. Who else would venture into inhospitable climes and wake me from some slumber sweet, but my beloved fan? Why do I feel like I have step through a portal into an alternate <laughs> reality unbound by the laws of logic? Because yeah. you did! You, ju <laughs> you just got yourself into Manderville shit. You're looking in this situation, like, yeah. what the fuck's going on? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you yeah, might as well accept works. it, dude. <laughs> just let it happen, dude. You are drawn to this now. You are drawn to this now. There's your little hair. Too. What is that? What is that? A mammoth? A <laughs> a Where did this come from? Fucking dancer. Mm -hmm. Oh, that? When my father drove me into the earth, I found it buried beneath the snow. A little lalafelling girl! How adorable! Nashu, please! Note the firm muscular legs, not unlike my own. Tis clearly a lalafelling boy! Now that you mention it, I suppose his feet his are rather masculine. You two cannot possibly be serious! I am the very soul of seriousness, good sir, especially in matters of deduction. This is undoubtedly a young boy who, much like myself, fell into a deep slumber upon being buried beneath the snow. Now then, let us gently wake him and ascertain his identity. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking love him! He God birds the answer to everything. There. Well, he does have the magic fix it hammer. There. That ought to do it. <laughs> this is looking at his face. <laughs> What? What is this place? Who? Who am I? Who am I? Oh! Look what at the oh, What the God, fuck? Bro. He fell in love with him. He's like, you're cute. Oh, God. I can only imagine what his voice sounds like. Who? It would seem that although Father's ungentle ministry- Some cutscenes, no voice, but other cutscenes, voice. Go figure. Yeah. 
It would seem that although Father's ungentle ministrations served to restore this young boy to life, they also robbed him of his memory. Oh, no. It's like he has been How did I get him. here? Who am I? Why can I not remember? We're taking up dark mages. Do not worry, young man. Everything will be all right. Take it from me. I have lost my memory more times than I can even remember. Then... Then can you help me to remember? Hearken to me now, for I... Black Mage. Hearken to me now, for I, Hildebrand, agent of inquiry, inspector extraordinaire, do hereby swear to solve the mystery of the amnesic hobbledyhoy. Wonderful, wonderful. I'll get started on a bash of Nash's delights. Ah, effective as your explosives were in the past. I suspect young Gigi, young Gigi lacks the hardy constitution required to survive such an approach. Gigi? Is that my name? When you woke up, you were morning, muttering Gigi Gigi. I suspect the phrase may hold some significance for you. So until such time as we learn your real name, I say, why not adopt it as a playful moniker? But, but that's just the sound all mammoths make. Uh, what kind of imbecile goes and names a mammoth Gigi anyway? Gigi, I like this name. Thank you, kind sir. But how will this new name help me to remember who I am? Patience, Gigi, this is only the beginning. Next, we will return to the city and see if we cannot find any who know who you are. Come along. They're not gonna find anyone. Uh. Now that I know our overlord is safe and sound, I too must take my leave of you and return to my brothers. I dare say rigor mortis will set in if I remain here any longer. Bound for Thanala, then allow me to accompany you. Julian will give me he got no end of trouble if I keep her waiting much longer, so perhaps she will forgive me once I tell her of Hildy's return. This is a ra this is rather a lot to digest. Though you have the look of one accustomed to such happenings. In any case, regardless of Mistress Nash's protestations, the Inspector will not be granted access to the capital until we can confirm that he is not a heretic. You have my word that he will be treated fairly. Speak with Siren Foundation. Oh, yeah. oh you're gonna have one? Oh, cool. We're gonna invite you to put a baby on it so I get updates. Oh, cool. And there is Seer. Oh, yeah. Fury, take me, that man! Ah! Oh. Bion. I suppose you have heard the news, then? That Inspector Pildren was cleared of all suspicion and judged to be no more than an eccentric curiosity. If you are looking for him, good luck. I wanted to thank him for his cooperation, but as soon as the Temple Knights released him, he and his assistant ran off to God's Nowhere with that mammoth in tow. As for my investigation, in spite of all the twists and turns, I managed to salvage a satisfactory result. As far as the Inquisition is concerned, the suspicious vagabond was not more than a zombie which wandered away from the dust vigil, sickness which has since been purged. So it would seem that all is right with the world once more. For now. I have no doubt that the inspector will turn up again like a bad gill, and when he does, trouble is sure to follow. Oh, you have no idea. <laughs> he has no idea. He really has no clue what he, he just stumbled onto. But anyway, let's enjoy a cutscene.
Because guess who's back? <laughs> oh, and they use the Cowboy Bebop reference. But yeah, for now, that will be com that will complete the Hildebrand quest line for now. When we return, we will uh, not only continue with the Hildebrand bullshit, but um, we will also be continuing with the Scholastic Hit quest. But that will not be until we return back to Chris Valentine. So um, we do have um, like one or two more things to do, but I need to organize a party for that, and, uh, actually, no, actually, now that I think about it, I only have one more dungeon to do before I can return back to, uh, yeah, one more dungeon to do before I can, uh, return back to Chris Valentine, because once I hit, once I do that last, uh, dungeon that's it i can i can go back for uh the last part of the uh, the last uh part of this patch and then everything else is just easy pickings so i have one more trial one more hard mode dungeon to complete and then i am getting the fuck off of bayon and transferring all the guild back to everything but until such time as we return <laughs> Thanks to Chemo Sobriety and BBC for joining me. And until next time, Cruise It Gex out. No one's home. <laughs>